Okay, so in this lecture, I'm going to be demonstrating a really cool feature of this app called Descript called Overdub. So basically the way it works is, suppose that you've cloned your voice. And so this applies to people like me who produce online content with their own voice. So suppose that I uh, recorded myself saying something, but then I made a mistake. And so I don't want to record the whole thing again. Suppose I just want to replace a single word. And so Overdub, not only does it allow you to clone your own voice, it allows you to replace words if you make a mistake. So in this lecture, I'm going to demonstrate how that can work. Okay, so I'll start by creating a new project. While we're here, don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. You know you want to. And I'll call this Overdub Test. And so I'll start by uploading a file called test overdub. And so in this file, what I'm saying basically is two plus two equals five. We all know that two plus two equals four. So two plus two equals five. And I'm going to change that mistake to four. Okay, so you can see that immediately after I upload the audio file, it automatically transcribes it. So that's actually another very useful feature of this program. So if you have a need for transcription, say you want to add subtitles to your videos, um, this program does that as well. Okay, so we can see that it says, I just learned that two plus two equals five. Math is so fun. Okay, and so we know that two plus two is not equal five, it's equal to four. So we're going to change this. Well, let's hear how it sounds first. So now usually there's like a little play button down at the bottom. I'm not seeing it for some reason. So let me get out of here and come back in. Okay, so now we see um, the audio that I just uploaded. So let me play this. I just learned that two plus two equals five. Math is so fun. Okay, so it says, I just learned that two plus two equals five. Math is so fun. And we know that two plus two is not equal five, it's equal to four. So let's say I wanted to replace this with the word four. Okay, so how can I do that? So correct, that's not the right thing to do. That means you want to correct the transcription. Overdub is the feature you want. So what you want to do is you click overdub. Okay, so then it says assign a speaker label. So I've already created my speaker uh, labels and my voices because I've already cloned my voice. So I'm going to go to LP, which is me. And so now I can do overdub again. And now I can replace five with four. And then I click overdub. And so right after you do that, this part will show up blank for a while. Um, and then eventually it'll fill with a waveform. Okay, so you see now the text has changed. It says two equals four. And the part that's changed is now highlighted in blue. Okay, so if I replay this, now it sounds like, I just learned that two plus two equals four. Math is so fun. Okay, so the timing is a bit off. Um, that doesn't always happen. So you could try doing it again and seeing if that helps. So the problem is there's no space between four and math. So let me try to enter a comma there. See if that will help. No, I didn't do anything. Uh, let me uh, try to overdub this again. Okay, so I'll go overdub equals four comma. Okay. So it is generating audio again. Okay, so let's try this again. Okay, and so I did cancel my account. So currently I don't have a premium account. And what happens when you only have a free account is your um, vocabulary is limited to 1,000 words. So that might come into play here. I don't know why it's the exact same words from before. Maybe the comma screwed it up, but let's try. I just learned that two plus two gibber four. Math is so fun. Oh, I guess equals is not a word in the vocabulary. So that's why it didn't work the second time because the first time we didn't include the word equals. Uh, in the overdub. So, so anyway, you guys get the idea behind how this works. So maybe let's just try it one more time. Um, we'll 
do a test two. I'll upload the same file again. Okay, so we'll wait for this to transcribe. Okay, so now we have back our original audio and I'm going to change this again. Okay, so we have to set the speaker, which I'm going to set to LP. And I'm going to change this. This time I'll change it to four comma and we'll see if that helps. So overdub and now it's blank again and we just wait for it to fill in. Okay, so let's see how this sounds. I just learned that two plus two equals four. Math is so fun. Okay, so it seems that the comma helps. So now there's a space between four and math. Okay, so now let's uh, summarize all the applications of Descript. I think this is a really cool app because not only does it do voice cloning, which is obviously relevant for this course, but it has other useful features as well. So as we saw, it can transcribe text. And so that's something, again, that content creators like myself need quite often. And you'll find that on some platforms that do it automatically, the quality of those transcriptions isn't that good. Now, YouTube happens to be pretty good, so um, that could be one option if you're just uploading your videos to YouTube. However, from YouTube, you can't export the subtitle files. So if you'd like to export the subtitle files, Descript is an app that can do that for you. Now, the main feature we were looking at in this lecture was overdub. So overdub, again, so this course is all about making audio and video of people who are saying things they didn't really say. Okay, and so you can imagine how that can be applied. So we saw that you can replace words in an audio recording. Now, for me, my use case for this is more for myself because I make mistakes in my own audios and I need to fix them but you can imagine applying that to someone else's voice as well to make them say something different from what they actually said. Now, there is a caveat to this, which is that with Descript, you do have to upload a big long file of the voice so that they can actually train a model to clone your voice. So this is unlike the other technologies we looked at, which seem to be zero shot or one shot learning where you don't actually train a network, it just tries to copy your voice using the characteristics of an existing recording. And because Descript actually trains a new model, I found that it captures the qualities of my voice much better, so it actually sounds like me. Whereas you saw with um, some of the other technologies, they don't really sound like me, it sounds like some other person, they don't really sound that close to my voice or the way that I speak. So back to this caveat, I'm not sure if this app allows you to upload voices of other people. Um, you can always try that. I've never done it. I've only ever cloned my own voice. So, so because there are ethical considerations behind cloning someone else's voice, um, it's possible that they may not allow you to do that. So you want to check that yourself if you're interested in this app. Now, another cool thing about this app, although it's mainly advertised for say fixing an audio recording by replacing words here and there, you can actually use the same feature to generate whole strings of text. And I've done this before. Um, sadly, it doesn't sound that good. But um, basically, so say I didn't, I created a lecture, I didn't want to record it, and I just wanted the you know AI to do it for me. What I could do is just write up the whole lecture myself in text form, upload it to Descript, and then it would generate the whole audio using that text in my voice, as if I had read it. Okay, so that's another application of Overdub. So you don't even need to start with an existing recording. You can just generate speech from scratch. Okay, so finally, where can you get Descript? So I've included a link to Descript in the extra section, which you can just click on directly. So check that out if you find the features of this app uh, useful for your workflow. Did you like this video? I know I did. So what are you waiting for? Go ahead and like it, share it, comment, and subscribe. You'll be glad you did.